Hey, it's Joseph here. Today I am doing a quick tip for you. So let's just go ahead. So if we look at the screen here, you will see a very simple rectangle that I have drawn, which is 10 inch by 10 inch. If I select that segment right there, the entity info will confirm that it is 10 inches. However, if I select here, you'll see that it is actually broken down into smaller segments, one more there and one more there. Just to confirm with the line tool, if I hover over here, it will be an endpoint with the green bubble and if I go here it will be light blue and it will say midpoint and it will be another green and an end point however if I go here it will be end point with a green instead of light blue showing midpoint only it is highlighted here and if I go here because it will be in between the smaller segments so basically I am trying to show there is a broken down segment of edges within this 10 inch line. So how do I actually see this a lot clearer? If you go to the styles dialog, edit, and make sure you click on this cube here, which is the edge styles, and you can just turn on endpoints here and the endpoints will be visible on your screen. However, if it is not so visible, then you can also type in something more than two, which is three, or four even, and then you'll see the endpoints growing in size, and you'll be able to see it a lot clearer. So I get that, but how do we actually remove these? Because you probably don't want all of these segments showing up in the middle of your model. Well, if you go and try to select the vertices, you'll probably not be able to select anything, which is a native behavior of SketchUp. There's not really native way to select vertices. So you can go line tool, L for short, and then draw a line and then you can select that line and delete. As you delete, you'll see that segment has been merged together. Another one is L and then draw another edge anywhere really. It doesn't really matter where you draw it to, but take an eraser tool, E for short, and then you can just delete that line as well. So that was a quick tip on how to merge edges if that happens to you and bothering you.